My name is Joe Edwards. I'm here at JTEC, the Automotive Technology Program. Today we're going to be doing two kinds of brake line flaring. We're going to be doing a double flare, and on the other side I'm going to do a ISO or bubble flare. So we're going to start by picking our bit and find the correct slot for the line. This is a 3 16th. Going to put it up here on the vise assembly. Going to bring it down to where it is just up to that first lip on the bit. Then I'll tighten it a lot. A lot, a lot. But not too much. Because it can't. So tightening. And a tightening. Continuing to tighten. And I think that's good. Then we have this, this machine piece here. Not really a machine. I guess you could call it a machine. Okay. Yeah. That last part sucked. Alright. We got it in the machine. Then we're going to take this, clean out the hole where it has been cut because it does have a tendency to lip over on the inside. Got that nice and cleaned out now. Then we're going to take the bit, pointy side, into the line. We're going to take this mechanism here, put this end into the concave end of the bit, and tighten it down. Then we're going to tighten this down, just until the end of the bit is flush with the flare, the brake flare vice assembly. Right. So we've got, this, we've got the, uh, the bit part mushed down. Then we're going to take this end here and put it directly in the end of the line. And we're flaring. Alrighty, tighten it down just so. I'm satisfied with how tight that is. I'm gonna release it. Release from the vise. All right, and there we have a double flared brake line. All right, so we've done the double flare, and now we're going to do a bubble flare or an ISO flare. So we have our main flaring device here, our bit, a 3 16th, and our housing, also a 3 16th. So we're going to loosen this up here, I'm twisting this part, moving this part back, and then I'm going to set it aside for a moment. I'm going to get this flush in here so it's just up to the end of it. You don't want it anymore or you're going to mess it up. Yeah, we go with flat flare. Yummy, yummy, yummy. That's not Like this. And you don't want that. Not bad. <laughs> so I put the housing into the mechanism. <laughs> My fist! <laughs> Continue to make sure that it's completely flush. We tighten this down. Don't want that going anywhere. Then we're going to add our bit, and then we're going to tighten this down until it meets the end of the tubing. <laughs> right. So we got it flush here, got the pin going into the tube, this is tight, that's tight, it's all good here. Then we're going to close this valve here, and squeeze the handle until we, get vi until we uh, go from very little resistance to a lot of resistance. And there it is. We're going to release it, you can see it draw back. Pull it away. 
Undo, unclamp the housing. There you have bubbled or ISO flare.